Welcome to the full guide to editing in Alitu. To start off with, you need to create an episode. Don't worry, you can fill in the rest of the details later. Upload a file where you can record something or add something from your library to your episode. Once this is uploaded into your episode, you will have the option to edit that audio file. The settings button inside the editor allows you to control some aspects of how the editor looks and behaves. Any changes made will be applied straight away. You can update the settings as often as you like, working out what works best for you in the editor. Making an edit inside Alitu is easy. Simply navigate to the edit button on your audio file, click where you would like to edit and press cut this out, as shown in the video. Use a drag and drop approach to make your edit. Don't worry, if you forget to press cut this out, if you make an edit and then you make another one, Alitu will automatically close the last edit for you without you having to press cut this. Previewing an edit is easy in Alitu. You can navigate to any one of your edits, select the preview button and that will allow you to hear what the audio sounds like with that edit in place. You can also preview your audio by using the playback settings in the bottom toolbar of the waveform. The restore function allows you to remove an edit and reinstate your original audio. To do this, click on an edit, navigate to the restore button, select it, and this will remove the edit and reinstate your original audio. You can also use the undo buttons to cancel any previous actions performed. To make small, precise edits, use the zoom function in the bottom left-hand corner of the editor. Select an area of audio that you want to make a small cut and zoom in. Make your cut as normal. You can zoom out to 100% at the click of a button. For the purposes of this video, I had the auto zoom turned off, so I was controlling the zoom manually, but you can switch this on inside the editor preferences. It will automatically zoom in when you make a cut and automatically zoom back out after the cut. You can turn one audio file into two by using the split function. Move the playhead bar to the position you want to split your clip. Press split. Give the two new files appropriate names. And then press split. Any edits made previous to the split will still be present in your new files. Magic Filters allows you to remove unneeded silences and filler words like ums and as. Click on the Filters button, toggle on what filters you want to apply to your audio. When you press Apply, this will create an edit in your audio. You can adjust it, restore it, save it and preview it, just like with all other edits. You can also edit by text or transcription editing inside Alitu. To use this, simply toggle on the audio transcript button at the bottom of the editor and allow a transcript to be generated of your audio. To make an edit using the transcription, highlight the text using the same drag and drop approach and select cut this out. You will note there is a corresponding edit produced on the wavelength. You still have all the same features. You can open up an edit, save it, preview it and restore it just as you could in the wavelength. You have the option to expand the transcript, taking advantage of a full screen view. But we've also given you the flexibility to switch between the two editing modes. By shrinking the transcript, this will bring back the wavelength editor. The transcript comes with a search function. This makes it easy to identify words in a transcript that perhaps you want to edit out. Thanks for watching and happy editing.